So we're filming. Alright, what are we filming? I don't know. I haven't made up <laughs> yet. <laughs> we'll work on it as we go. I suppose I can just cut out stupid sections, which is going to be the majority of the video. Yeah, that's alright. Alright, so we're down here at, I don't know, Randy's Garage? Yeah, Randy's <laughs> Garage. In Randy's Garage, working on a 2012? 2012, technically. 2012 Mustang. Um, I'm sure you've seen some of the dyno videos of this in the past, but he's made some changes for this upcoming season. So, what changes have you made? What changes have we made? Let's see, bigger injectors, bigger fuel system, um, some upgrades to the uh, blower piping, uh, uh, automatic. Uh, so it's got a 6R80 swap? 6R80 swap. Uh, select shift so we can we can manually shift it um, what other changes do we have we've got a uh, cooler and fan rear mounted for the trans uh, yeah so you know open for big power and, and fun things so who built the motor uh, my six-year-old son no, I'm just kidding <laughs> uh, uh, Ricky and friends over at DC racing engines built the motor uh, looks beautiful on the inside, so we'll hope it uh, hope it makes some steam. So it's all done to the motor. So dart and sleeve motor. Uh, this blocks from L and M. Um, uh, really, really ported heads <laughs> uh, via Ricky uh, and DC Racing valve springs. Everything replaced. It has uh, L and M custom intake cams, um, manly pistons, uh, billet I beam rods, uh, forged crank. Uh, bigger pan, uh, billet oil pump gears, upgraded timing chain and uh, retainers. So, if it if it can be changed, we tried to change it. And what blower are we running? It's a Vortec YSI uh, with a billet impeller, so a YSI B on an extraordinarily small pulley. And two point five pulley. It looks like you got someone to powder coat everything for you. Lee at uh, Pristine Powder Coating. Lee Goldstein did a fantastic job as usual powder coating the front of the blower, the pipes, um, a few other odds and ends, coolant tank and so on. Uh, Lee's the man and a fellow Mustang guy. That always helps. That looks, yeah, you can see the timing cover and all that. Yeah, he did the timing cover as well. So what injectors are you going to be running? 1700s, ID 1700s. And it's a full four fuel system? Uh, it's a, it's, it was, it's going to be a four fuel hat. <laughs> with um, uh, new lines, JPC Racing uh, Dash 10 billet rails. Um, so it started out life as a four system and is a bit of a hybrid at this point. Looks like you're still running that boss intake. Any plans to switch that out to that sheet metal one that everybody's running? The Holly? Yeah. Sniper? Uh, I don't know. I'm not, uh, I'm not sure yet. I, I like the Sniper. I'm just not convinced that it's really going to give me a whole lot at the, at the boost level I'm at. I think, it, I think it's a necessity if we go a little bit higher. And I know we changed out the intercooler on the supercharger kit. Uh, whose intercooler is this? Intercooler uh, was made by, um, it's a Garrett core, uh, assembled, welded by Chisel Performance. It is as much intercooler as I thought I could fit between those rails. In fact, Ooh. it doesn't really fit, but we yeah. jammed it in as much as we could. <laughs> yeah, and I think uh, Bear down at Dino Pro is the one that came up with the mounting system. Bear did, so it's removable and uh, came up with uh, side mounts. So four bolts, it'll pop out the bottom. We wedged it as tight as we could with a little, uh, just some, some rubber shoved in between, keep it from squeaking and rubbing. Uh, but it keeps it cool. All right, and then um, what do you think you're gonna have to do this tune? To, uh, hopefully Sunday. Sunday or Monday, but okay. hopefully Sunday. Try and make some steam and uh, break it in. So, uh, what all are your goals for the car? Like horsepower wise, I know you're building it for the mile. Any mile per hour hopes? I don't, I don't really know yet. I'd, I'd like to uh, get around 210, maybe 210-ish in the mile. Uh, not sure what to expect yet in the half mile. We'll find out soon. Horsepower, 1200-ish up here, SAE, and then you know, take it to sea level and see what we get with a couple extra pounds of boost. Um, so yeah, that's, that's about it. Like so what exhaust it. are you running? Uh, this is these are JPC headers uh, going through um, Borla X pipe and over axles, and uh, I'm using Ford Racing Touring mufflers actually to try and quieten it down. And I also put some 
vibrant resonators in. I'm I'm uh, going the opposite way as I used to. I, w I wanted everything loud, now I want it a little bit quieter. Sounds good. Just gonna get a few more shots here, I think, and maybe splice them in or something. I yeah. don't know. <laughs>